All right, so let's take a look here at Argo versus Flex. So the CNCF have two CI/CD projects that serve the same purpose, but take a different approach. And both of these are in the incubating stage, so they're all uh, both safe to use, unless you're super enterprise and you have some kind of concern. Um, but uh, we have Flux and Argo. So let's talk about the difference. So Flux was originally developed by Weaveworks. Uh, it takes a CLI first approach. It's experimental web UI as a plugin, so you can get a visual thing. It supports role-based access controls. It supports multi-tenancy in Flux 2. So if you're using Flux 1, you won't have that. It supports Helm and customization, and that's the logo for Weaveworks. Uh, and it has automation of container updates. Let's take a look at what Argo does. So it has both a CLI and web UI. So it's had a little bit more to start with. Supports role-based access controls, supports single sign-on, supports multi-tenancy, Helm, customization, case on it, uh, uh, JSON it, manual commit and sync to update containers. And so you might say, well, it looks like Argo basically has almost everything, so why not just use it? Well, generally Flux is simpler in design and CLI focused. So if you need to get off the ground real fast, Flux is very popular um, if you want a simple solution. Um, but you know, they do have a lot of overlap and you'll just have to decide for yourself uh, which one it is you wanna use.